Welcome back to the Not So Nice Gamers. We are. Ah! Yeah. Rats! What did I tell you about that? Stop it! Shut up, boy! Oh, we're over here getting uh, brick, aren't we? Is that where we left off? We're here to talk to I don't remember. Brickety brick, brick, brick. Brick, brick, brickety brick. Uh, so, Ryan, what happened to your windshield? I don't want to talk about it. You don't want to talk about it? Why do you not want to talk about it? I'll talk about it. Would that, would that be better? Um, suicide, suicide Squad just came out. Potato brain, you're a potato brain. Anyway, Suicide Squad just came out, and I was on Facebook, and I got this little thing. This one, of this ad came up, and it was like, "Get a free ticket to Suicide Squad if you download this app." It was like one of those like ticket buying apps where like you know you use it to buy a ticket to a movie theater, and you can actually it's actually a pretty cool app. You can also, like, you can buy your ticket and, like, any of the concessions you want. And when you go there and you scan it, they, like, you go to the theater and it's a QR phone, a QR uh, barcode on your phone. And you, they scan it. And they just get everything ready right then and there. Uh, I might actually use it again in the future. But anyways, the only reason I downloaded it is because it came with a free movie ticket. I was like, okay, whatever. So I downloaded it. It worked. My dog just headbutted me. Um, and I called our buddy Andrew. And Andrew asked me to go see Suicide Squad with him last week. I was like, ah, I can't right now. But I called him and was like, hey, so I got a free ticket to Suicide Squad. Do you want to go with me? Because I'm going with or without you. He's like... Yeah, I'll go. I was like, all right, cool. So we drive like the 45 minutes to the movie theater that the ticket was to. Because it was one of those, I chose one of those up class since it was a free ticket. It was ended up, it would have been like a $25 ticket because I chose an, up, uh, an upper really? class. Yeah. Why would I chose for a fucking like, ticket? I chose one of the really fancy theaters. Okay. So, um, it, it would have been like 25 bucks. So we drove out there, we went, and while we were driving out there, I had a gnat in my car. You know, a tiny bug. It was being a pest. So, I'm doing, you know, I'm like trying to kill it by like thumbing it. Fucking psychos. Got here, shotgun midget. Anyway, you were saying? I was thumbing at the gnat, trying to smush it against the windshield. And I look and I look over and Andrew, like, bitch slaps my windshield. And I was about to say, hey, man, do it a little softer next time. Or, like, hey, be careful. Don't break my windshield. And before I could say it, he does it again. And he cracks my windshield. <laughs> and I don't mean, like... A little crack. I'm talking like, it looks like somebody hit my windshield with a baseball bat. <laughs> That's fucking hysterical. I was at work and you gave me the, when when I got that voicemail, and I fucking died laughing. It was the funniest thing I heard heard all day. But I was just like, I looked at him. Have Kind of froze in his place, and um, I'm stuck. I mean, he froze stuck. in his place, and I, uh, I was like, "You know, you're gonna pay for that, right?" He's like, yeah. He's like, "I was doing so good saving up money." <laughs> well, this is <laughs> so you can break your friend's windshield. So How much does the windshield cost, anyway? So I, I went through USAA, the people I have insurance through, uh -huh. and uh, 
It's gonna be like if I go to USA, it's gonna be like I since I have a five hundred dollar deductible, it's gonna be like three hundred thirty bucks. Damn. I sent it to Andrew. I was like, hey, look, this is how much it's going to cost if we go through USA. I was like, or you can find a cheaper place and uh, pay for it that way. <laughs> and what do you say to that? I, I sent it to him like as I emailed it to him, to his work ID from mine, like as uh -huh. I was leaving. So I don't I didn't get a response yet. Ooh, a ripage. I see. I see. Said the blind man to his deaf son. Do you need the ripager? Uh, no, I'm good. <laughs> but I've been giving him. Sh I gave him shit about it all night long. Like we were watching Suicide Squad and the scene where uh, Harley Quinn gets thrown through the windshield uh -huh. underwater. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah. I was like, oh look, look, Andrew, she breaks windshields too. Shut up. <laughs> you know, I would have probably done the same thing Just give him shit all fucking night about it It only seems right We park We we are having problems finding a parking spot At the movie theater I was like I'll just park way in the back He's like that's where I always park Park anyways I was like yeah I like to park in the back So nobody damages my car And I like looked over at him <laughs> <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> we're, we were always so mean to Andrew. <laughs> like, just where I like, like the entire duration I knew him, I never knew his phone number. Like, I never had his phone number. I had no way of contacting him. He just kind of showed up whenever you showed up. Yeah, he's attached to me at the hip. A little bit, a little bit, but he's a good guy. Always has been. I remember one day he was having problems with women finding one and you know me how I do and um one day he came up like he was pacing and I was actually like on the phone with a girl he had a hardcore thing for <laughs> and um well cause like she, he had a thing for her, like oh, like this like motherfucker just threw a grenade backwards. <laughs> like, yeah. I was behind him, shooting him in the back of the head, and he just fucking, like, throws it forward, but the grenade goes backwards. This motherfucker. Anyway, I'm sorry, uh, what were you saying? Andrew had this hardcore thing for this girl. And, uh... She knew it. Because he made it obvious. Yeah, you know, I, I can't deny he was kind of creepy with it, but she took advantage of it and would try to get him to do pretty much like whatever she wanted. You know what I'm talking about? Just yeah. Like, yeah. And uh, she had a thing for me. I don't know why, but she did. I never understood that. So I, uh, I took advantage of that and made her feel like shit. Because I did the same thing to her that she was doing to Andrew. Anyways, so, like, one day we were soccer coaches together for a youth team. And I was on the phone with her. And I got off the phone. He's like, I just don't get it, man. He's pacing. I was like, what's wrong? He's like, you and I are, like, the same person. Why do you get all these women? I was like, hold up. Stop right there. Like, did you just say we're the same person? He's like, yeah. We look the same. We act the same. He's like, no. no. He's like, we have the same job. He's like, no. It's like, kind of, but no. Oh. No. <laughs> like, that was the first time I've ever been offended by something. <laughs> because he said that you guys were the same person? Yeah. It's like, we're the same person. He's like, how fucking dare you? <laughs> <laughs> God. There we Thank go. You. I was having problems. Isn't this your line? 
No. That was awesome. Awesome. Oh. I love Brick. <laughs> Brick is my boo. I'm oh, Brick. <laughs> now what you want? So what you want? <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! I got teleported. <laughs> hey, hey! Time. You have to kill the sarcastic oh. slab. Where's the sarcastic slab? Wait for this to stop talking. Okay. <laughs> You've never seen that before? No, I didn't know. That's funny as hell. He walks out just fucking slow collapsing and shit. Like, Good yeah, job, guys. I, I was waiting for him every time. Ah, a radium drink. We need to do another drunken Borderlands. Uh, maybe we'll do a drunken DLC. How's that? Uh, I don't wanna. We could do the drunken uh, Valentine's Day one. Eh, uh, you don't really get a whole lot. Oh, uh, the Valentine's Day one. Yeah, but you know what? We can talk about that in the next episode, because we are out of time. No, we're not. You're a racist. Anyway, like, comment, subscribe. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the next Fuck one. Fuck you, Derek. Peace out, homies. Fuck you, Derek. That's what we call branding, children. What are you? No, nah, that's what they just said. Oh, you're being chased, Justin. He thinks you're cute. Ah! Josh, what are you doing?